Blackrock finally breaks the silence. Let's not forget its massive impact on Shiba Inu. You remember how Shiba Inu tripled in price in just a couple of days? Well, looks like the story might repeat. The Blackrock with its billions of US dollars is ready for the next move. And that is a major win for Shiba Inu Army and the entire crypto space. But what is actually happening? And why am I being so bullish? Well, let's find out. Disclaimer, it finally happened. The BlackRock Bitcoin Trust has finally flipped the grayscale. Bitcoin Trust as the largest Bitcoin ETF following the latest round of inflows. This development has been catching our attention for quite some time. Just after the Bitcoin ETF was approved back in January, we saw Grayscale, an entity with significant Bitcoin holdings, start dumping millions of dollars worth of Bitcoin every day. This created substantial selling pressure, causing multiple market crashes and leaving many of the world's largest Bitcoin companies in the world. To understand how this works, here's something important. When a large entity like Grayscale sells off massive amounts of Bitcoin, it floods the market with supply, driving down the price. This consistent selling created a downward force on the market, resulting in significant volatility and downturns. This is where the BlackRock joined with its daily accumulations of Bitcoin. Unlike Grayscale, which was offloading its holdings, BlackRock maintained a 71-day streak of consistent inflows. Without any dumping or flat numbers, this consistent buying acted as a counterbalance to Grayscale selling. It was like a tug of war. Grayscale was creating significant selling. Pressure with its dumps, while BlackRock was scooping up the Bitcoin, steadily increasing its holdings. And now... With BlackRock's holdings finally exceeding Grayscale's, the dynamic shifts. The selling pressure from Grayscale won't be as massive as it was in the past because BlackRock is now the top holder. Shiba Inu holders are very happy right now. For some reason, Shiba Inu is super sensitive to Bitcoin movements, often reacting more dramatically than it should. For instance, when Bitcoin dumped by 5%, Shiba Inu followed suit, but dropped even more, sometimes by 10%. And now, with BlackRock's victory over Grayscale, this is very, very good news for Shiba Inu holders. The significant selling pressure from Grayscale's Bitcoin dumps had a ripple effect across the entire crypto market, hitting sensitive assets like Shiba Inu particularly hard. With BlackRock's victory over Grayscale, this is very, very good news for Shiba Inu holders. With BlackRock now holding the top spot and consistently buying Bitcoin, the entire crypto market is likely to experience more stability. This should help mitigate the extreme volatility that Shiba Inu often experiences in response to Bitcoin's movements. As a result, Shiba Inu holders can look forward to a more stable market environment, reducing the dramatic swings that have been so common. BlackRock now holds Bitcoin's worth a staggering $19.4 billion. Eric Balkunas, a well-known ETF analyst, has the story. He said, from Bloomberg confirmed BlackRock's achievement, emphasizing that this fund is on track to make History is the fastest ETF to reach $20 billion in assets under management. The current record holder is the JP Morgan Equity Premium Income ETF, which took 985 days to cross the $20 billion mark. Remarkably, the BlackRock Bitcoin ETF has only been trading for 137 days, including non-business days. To put this into perspective, the difference is astounding. Imagine running a marathon where most participants finish in around 900 days. Then, out of nowhere, someone comes along and finishes the same marathon in just 100 days. The sheer speed
speed and efficiency are mind-blowing, highlighting just how rapidly the BlackRock Bitcoin ETF is growing compared to its predecessors. This incredible pace underscores the fund's unprecedented momentum and the significant impact it could have on the market. And here's something interesting. Eric Balchunas mentioned in his Twitter post that he was a big fan of the BlackRock Bitcoin ETF. It's official now. BlackRock Bitcoin ETF is king of the category, and prob will be for decades. The low fee, big boy liquidity, and the shares brand name is just too powerful. Although there's plenty of food for everyone. This tweet confirms that BlackRock's Bitcoin ETF has firmly established itself as the leader in its category. Eric predicts that this dominance is likely to last for decades, emphasizing the ETF's long-term potential. He points out three main strengths driving this success. It's low fees, high liquidity, and the powerful issue's brand name. The low fees make the ETF cost-effective and attractive to investors. High liquidity means it can handle large transactions without significantly impacting. The market price, ensuring smooth trading. The Ishar is brand name, known for its credibility and trustworthiness, further enhances the ETF's appeal. Even though BlackRock is leading the pack, Eric notes that there's plenty of food for everyone, suggesting that while BlackRock's dominance is clear, there is still ample opportunity for other players in the market to succeed. This underscores the robust and growing nature of the cryptocurrency ETF space. In addition to all of that, we've just hit 12 consecutive days of positive flows to Bitcoin ETFs. This is amazing, because in the past, Bitcoin ETFs often faced bumps in the road with periods of outflows or even flat activity. So now, seeing 12 straight days of inflows is a remarkable turnaround. This streak of continuous inflows indicates a growing confidence and interest in Bitcoin ETFs among investors. It means that more people are putting their money into these funds betting on the long-term potential of Bitcoin and crypto in general. This positive trend suggests a bright future ahead for Bitcoin and its ETFs, as consistent inflows can lead to greater market stability and higher prices. The sustained interest and investment could mark the beginning of a more robust and resilient market for Bitcoin ETFs. And if you think that it only impacts Bitcoin, then you'll be wrong. As I have mentioned already, Bitcoin movements have a tight impact on Shiba Inu. This is probably one of the reasons Shiba Inu whales are going crazy today, because of all these good news. These positive developments could really mean that there is a bright future ahead for crypto. The interconnectedness between Bitcoin and altcoins, like Shiba Inu, demonstrates the ripple effect that positive news in the crypto market can have across various assets. As confidence grows in Bitcoin and its associated ETFs, it tends to spill over into other cryptocurrencies, boosting investor sentiment and driving up prices. This collective optimism signals a broader acceptance and recognition of the potential of cryptocurrencies as a legitimate asset class indicating a promising outlook for the entire crypto market in the future. And it looks like Shiba Inu Army was right. Just today, a massive transaction involving $12 million worth of Shiba Inu was spotted. On-chain data from Etherscan revealed that the transaction consisted of exactly 445 billion Shiba Inu tokens valued at $12 million. While the sending address belongs to Robinhood, the recipient remains unknown. However, data confirms that the recipient address now holds over 500 billion Shiba Inu, valued at more than $14 million. Notably, Shiba Inu represents the largest single holding by this whale, with Ethereum coming in second. 
This transaction marks the second Shiba Inu whale movement involving the wallet and Robin Hood. Over the past month, the address has been acquiring Shiba Inu tokens from Robin Hood and Zero Hash. Interestingly, the whale has also been systematically offloading some of the Shiba Inu tokens, recently moving out 200 billion Shiba Inu to two different wallets in the past two days. And this is where things get interesting. Due to this pattern of accumulation and distribution, it is difficult to ascertain if the address is an individual whale or one affiliated with Robin Hood. However, if this address turns out to be an individual whale, it's considered super bullish news. Whales withdrawing assets from crypto exchanges typically do so to hold on to their investments. If this is indeed an individual whale holding on to Shiba Inu, it signifies their confidence in the future of the token. And I don't think that the whale would make such a huge move out of blue. Such a significant investment suggests that thorough analysis and consideration were involved. And that is great, as the substantial amount involved in the transaction indicates that the whale sees positive potential in Shiba Inu's future. By holding on to their assets rather than selling, they are expressing their belief in the long-term value and growth prospects of Shiba Inu. This move could potentially inspire further confidence among other investors, contributing to a positive trajectory for Shiba Inu in the cryptocurrency market. And now, with BlackRock crushing grayscale, the bright future for crypto might finally have begun. Maybe that's why the whale decided to do what he did. But what is your opinion on that? Comment down below. I'd be eager to read your opinion. If you are curious to find more, then make sure to click on one of the videos you see on screen. And with that, we come to the end of this video. If you enjoyed the video, then please like this video and don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section. This really helps me with the YouTube algorithm. Also, please share this video to as many people as possible. Let's get this news out there.